Hi, I'm Mike Nickel, and I'm running for City Council in Ward 11. This is the City Budget for 2013. This document that the City of Edmonton uses, it's a, really its guide to deliver all the programs and services necessary to maintain and run our city. Contained in the budget are all the programs and scheduled expenditures ranging from road maintenance and public transit to police, fire, waste management, drainage, and so on. Now the point of the city budget is that it identifies the cost for these services and the sources of revenue to pay for these services, including property taxes and user fees. So let's go over some quick facts on the approved 2013 operating budget. The total civic operating budget is roughly $2 billion. According to the City Budget Office in 2012, if you owned a house worth $364,000, you paid just under $1,800 in municipal tax. This year, the administration is calling for an overall 3.3% increase in the property tax levy, 2.3% for civic programs, boards and commissions, and a 1% levy for our neighborhood rehabilitation programs. Now, this is a 33% increase in just five years which is 27% higher than expected inflation during the same time period. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is also well above the average wage rate increase for your average Edmontonian, again, over that same time period. Sounds complicated? Well, it doesn't have to be. All these numbers mean is that your municipal taxes have been going up faster than the rate of inflation and faster than your paycheck. Now, I think City Council can do a better job in holding those tax increases down. And let me show you why. Take a look at this pile of nickels. Every nickel in this pile represents a million dollars. Civic budget is approximately two billion dollars, so here we have about 2,000 nickels. This year, the administration is asking for 64 more nickels to add to this pile to keep the same levels of services and perhaps add a little more because we're a growing city. So let's compare 64 nickels against 2,000 and see how it looks. I think if City Council really wanted to, we could find some of these 64 nickels within the civic budget and reduce the size of the proposed tax increase. Many residents of Ward 11 have told me that they have hit the wall when it comes to taxes and they not only expect, but need City Council to do more with the money they collect. And looking at the pile of dollars we have to work with, I think we can, don't you? Experienced Strong Voice. October 21st, vote Mike Nickel for Ward 11. Every nickel counts.